What's up guys what's going on my name is gg fizz how's everyone doing today if you don't know i'm a huge damn fan of horizon zero dawn so i am super excited to go over the new horizon forbidden west uh digital goodies that we're going to be getting pre-orders have started now link in the description down below if you want to take a look at all the stuff right there i'll put even timestamps as well for everything but we're going to go over all the digital goods because i am going to try and get this for ps5 i am going to try and get a ps5 for this i want to play it so bad uh the first one was absolutely incredible and amazing and i think the story was so mm, it was just so good uh so today we're gonna go over the pre-orders because they just released them and uh it's uh i don't uh, the pricing is a little bit confusing i think they're starting at like uh if you order the just a standard ps4 version because you can't get this for ps4 and ps5 uh i think it's like 60 dollars and then like the standard ps5 is like 70 and then it goes up from there uh so all that shit will be in the description uh but we're gonna go over all the stuff that you get uh through this so let's just start with the first one which is the digital deluxe edition digital deluxe you'll get the horizon for, uh forbidden west digital ps4 and ps5 version so they're doing is that basically if you buy um one of these digital deluxes for ps4 or ps5 you can cross play it on a ps4 and ps5 which is kind of cool I, I don't think you can play it at the same time obviously but you'll be able to switch like if you upgrade your ps4 to ps5 or whatever uh you can continue playing it which is kind of cool i don't know like how that all works but we'll, we'll have to wait and see on that um what else is there let's see so we have photo mode unlock we also have uh the uh claws striker pieces which is pretty cool uh in-game resource pack we, that's that's like kind of like standard whatever you know uh and then we also have digital soundtrack digital art book and then we have the two outfits so we have two special outfits uh Karja Behemoth Elite and Norse Thunder Elite those are inspired by new uh environments and creatures that are coming out the Behemoth one is obviously inspired by the big mammoth thing okay and then we also have two specialized weapons uh the Karja Behemoth sh sh uh, short bow and Norse Thunder String which is really cool sling not string sling uh mispronouncing but anyways that's really cool too they're really themed off of each other which is really cool um we i said we already have the in game thing exclusive photo mode and poses and face paints that's kind of interesting i know a lot of people do uh you know pose stuff online with a lot of different poses and stuff uh and then we also have a the graphic novel which is really cool that's like something uh that a lot of people like it's like kind of short story stuff i haven't read the horizon ones dawn ones but i heard that they were kind of okay so that's pretty cool and then we also have another uh we have a a, a cool little skin right here so let's zoom in real quick on this uh let's get over here uh this is the Nora legacy outfit and spear and you know who that reminds me of what's his name rust i think that's his name from the first game uh, the father figure i think that it's been a while since i played but uh yeah that kind of looks just like him i'm not gonna lie so that's gonna be really cool if that actually is themed off of him but yeah this is your digital deluxe i believe this one is like almost 80 dollars us i think it's just a little bit confusing the ps4 uh the ps5 site doesn't really it's not telling you the prices on a lot of this i mean look at it, like it doesn't it doesn't tell you so i have to like figure out where it is but I'm, i think this one's gonna be 80 dollars. but that's pretty cool so if you want to get it feel free i'm gonna try maybe getting this one we'll see we'll see all right so next we have is a special edition which to be honest is kind of like lackluster but i guess it's fine because uh what you get in this bonus is you get the metal case for either choice between ps4 or ps5 disc uh, 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 disc edition you also have a mini art book so probably like beautiful art pieces shown by the creative directors over there and uh you also get the other skin that we were just talking about the one that looks like rust so i have no idea what this one but i 
I have a feeling this would probably would be like $70. It doesn't feel like it would be, uh, 70, 80. I mean, I don't know. It doesn't have that oomph of a lot of uh, items in this. So, we'll, you know, take it for a grain of salt on this one. All right, next one is the collector's edition, which this one, they just ramp up the amount of stuff you get in this one. This one is pretty freaking cool. So let's take a look at it full screen. Boom, there it is. You get uh, you get the hardcover again, digital editions. You get the mini art book as well. And you get a damn freaking behemoth. Look at this. Oh, look at this thing. Look at this. Look at that. Look at this. That, oh, mm, that is so freaking amazing you also get all the skins that we sent previously you also get another smaller aloy kind of like a little statue stuff and i mean over uh, this this is really cool so this one i think if i found it correctly this one costs you about 200 dollars us yeesh so this statue alone is a uh, hundred dollars a uh, hundred plus dollars which is crazy but you also get the mini art book and you get the digital edition and you also get the hardcover metal uh tin case which is where my head is right here uh and then you also get full game steelbook at yeah, display case yeah so it's like a big box thing but yeah this is incredible but there's still another one after this so this is 200 dollars. i don't even know how much the other one is so let's let's take a look and lastly we get this this one uh, which I don't even know what's even called. It's called the uh, what is it? Regal edition a more uh, This is crazy. Let's take a look look at this. So the elephant now is Completely beefy. Uh, we also got two cards here Let me get rid of my head real quick so you guys can see we get two art cards, which is kind of cool We get a bunch of small little statue uh, Machine strike pieces uh, claw stunnings. I don't know what these are to be honest it's probably something We also get a canvas map which to be honest. This is kind of what I want. I would really really love that We also got a mini art book. Uh, we got all the different skins and we also get uh, I mean shit look at this uh, steelbook display case and over look at this thing i mean if you have if you have 260 dollars extra you could probably buy this one now for someone like me i have no idea if i could buy this i don't know if i have <laughs> i would love this i would love to do an unboxing video on this i I have no idea if I could buy something like this, so this would be incredible to own. Man, oh man. Maybe we'll do uh, something. Uh, and, you, oh, and you also get the focus re, uh, the focus thing as well. Stan, replica. This is incredible. So, yeah. So that is your pre-orders that you can get. Uh, I'm excited as hell. The game comes out in February. I'm going to try my damn hardest to get a PS5. I, I guess they're not adding... I guess there's not releasing a... Um, a ps5 with this so that means i could just try and find one so if you guys have any uh th thoughts or ideas on how to get a ps5 you know feel free put them in the comments down below i'd love to hear you but i would love to hear what your guys' thoughts are i would love to play this on day one of of this releasing this is one of my favorite games the first one was incredible and i would like to hear what you guys thought about these pre-orders i mean are they too expensive i haven't pre-ordered i haven't looked at pre-orders in a long time so i i have no idea i have no idea i remember they used to be like oh max dollars would be like 80 to 100 this is like freaking almost 300 dollars for this so anyways link in the description down below for everything you want to see thank you guys so much for watching hopefully you enjoyed and uh if you're a horizon zero dawn horizon fan like me then tell me guys what your you know favorite part of horizon is i'd love to hear it Thank you guys for watching. I'll see you guys in the next one.